One. Expanding the Audi G-Tron fleet. The A5 Sportback G-Tron. Remarkably economical to run, exceptionally clean, and impressively performant. Wonderful, wonderful. Ladies and gentlemen, with this A5 Sportback G-Tron, future driving starts right now. You already know this wonderful car that we introduced last year the A5 family to you. This car, however, is special. It runs on both, on gas and gasoline. It has special tanks for CNG, compressed natural gas, with a total capacity of 19 kilograms. Those tanks have an extra lightweight design, but are extremely strong. Running on CNG, ladies and gentlemen, the A5 Sportback Chitron covers up to 500 kilometers. Combined with this gasoline operation, its total range is 950 kilometers. The A5 Sportback Chitron takes us one step closer to CO2 neutral long distance mobility. It proves that sustainability can be super attractive. You're probably asking now, why is this car so eco-friendly? Because Vorsprung starts before you drive. From our point of view, the entire energy balance matters. Well to wheel, the Audi e-tron A5 Sportback Citron emits at least 80% less CO2 than comparable gasoline-powered cars. Because we made this possible by producing our own Audi e-gas, an innovative synthetic gas made from renewable energy resources and with CO2 capturing. We produce it, this gas, at our power to gas facility in Wörlte in Germany. Let's have a closer look at how this works, right where it happens. Let's have a direct line to Wörlte Hello, live in Welte, Ingolf Bauer. B greetings from Geneva. Hello to Geneva. How is the weather actually in Welte? Well, it's kind of cold, but the wind is picking up, so the power to gas plant is about ready to go. So, can you explain to the audience how this is working? Well, wind energy is, among other renewable energy sources, the base for the Audi e-gas production. And its power is being used for electrolysis. So right behind me, Audi splits water into hydrogen and oxygen. And in a second step, the hydrogen is being processed with CO2 to yield synthetic methane. And the CO2 comes from a biogas plant and arrives through these pipes. So actually, all it takes for the Audi e-gas production is uh, renewable energy, green electricity, water, and carbon dioxide. Perfect. Ingo, you are a science journalist in the German television. You are covering a lot of sustainable issues. What do you think about this kind of e-gas production? Well, the amount of CO2 that is emitted while driving is almost equal to the amount that is chemically bound in the production process for the fuel before. So, Audi actually recycles your CO2 emissions before you start driving. Now, that's a very holistic approach to sustainable mobility, I'd say. Oh, great. Thank you, Ingolf. Greetings to Welte. Ladies and gentlemen, to sum it up, if you drive an A5 Sportback Citron, you drive a super eco-friendly car without giving up anything. You get a sporty car with an emotional design and you can go long distance and refuel economically at any CNG gas station. And Audi takes care of your personal green footprint. We replace the amount of natural gas that you refuel with the Audi e-gas in the overall gas grid. In this way, we bind 
your car's CO2 emissions before you even start to drive. We are the first car manufacturing manufacturer to do that. And now we have a special offer for you all here in Europe. Whether you drive an A5 Sportback Citron, an A3 Sportback Citron, or an A4 Avant Citron, we, Audi, guarantee the Audi e-gas service for you for the first three years for your Citron. And for you, this service is for free. And now, ladies and gentlemen, we will have another look into the closer future of Audi. Thank you.